Well, you never quite know what's going to happen in this all-London fixture. West Ham United against Chelsea here at the London Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, former West Ham player, of course. What should we be expecting today? Well, if West Ham play at their very best and close Chelsea down and stop them playing, they could cause an upset here today. They're a good team when they're playing at home. This could be a really tight game. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukasz Fabianski stands between the posts. Kurt Zuma plays with Tito Kera in central defence. Declan Rice starts alongside Tomasz Socek in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy starts in goal. Kalidou Koulibaly plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Raheem Sterling plays with Christian Pulisic out wide. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Joao Felix. Havertz. On the ball, Zakaria. Kukureya. And he saw the situation developing. Jared Bowen. Good technique displayed. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Pulisic. On the ball, Joao Felix. Sterling. Nicely timed tackle. Individual brilliance. They might be able to get in now. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Paqueta. Oh, the threat is there. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Kai Havertz. Now, options are plenty. Well, oh, not great defending. Can he do it to take the lead? Raheem Sterling has done it. So lethal when he gets within sight of goal. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And it's a really good header as well. Sterling gets into a great position, makes exactly the right contact, and gives the goalkeeper no chance at all. That's a top-class goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Jared Bowen. Skamaka. Oh, this is looking promising. Spot on with that tackle. Sterling. And a West Ham throw-in coming up here. Declan Rice. Paqueta. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And he takes on the shot. 
No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Koulibaly. Great pressure to win the ball back. Pulisic. Now with Havertz. Fernandes. And that was a very fine read. Tomasz Sochek. Now with Paqueta. Keeping it moving dynamically. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Paqueta. And that brings to an end the first half here at the London Stadium. So back underway here into the second half. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And that pass could be troublesome. Pulisic. Well, it could be on for him here. And the ball is loose. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Well, just look how many chances Chelsea have created. Their attacking play has been a joy to watch. Unfortunately, the same can't be said about their shooting. They should be leading by more here. And struggling even to just get hold of the ball here. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Joao Felix. Well, he read that brilliant. Can he put them in front? James. And it's played into the centre. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Paqueta. Paqueta. Are they going to forge ahead? And technically offside, but not by a lot. And they will make the change now. Havertz. On the ball, Zakaria. Joao Felix. And can they create something? And Sterling has it. Crossed into the penalty area. Well, he's given it away. So far. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter. It's there for him. An important challenge, but they must remain organised. Rhys James. Pulisic. 
on the ball, Joao Felix. Will he find the net? And up for grabs off the keeper. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Oh, a vital save. And it remains all even. Well, there you have it. He may just have saved his team here. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Playing it in. Well, not cleared away completely. Firing it in. Superb block. In position at the back post, Obama Young. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Paqueta. Five minutes to go. Well, they have it again. Great ball from Raheem Sterling. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Declan Rice. Danny Ings now. Could be a chance to break here. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. And with play stop, they will make the change now. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides.